If you design websites using Divi or you're actually thinking of getting Divi to design your websites, using the Genesis template is going to allow you to design your websites even faster than ever before. So what the Genesis template does is it has a pre-built header footer, 404 page, and search results page. So if we take a look here, this is what you get when you install Divi by default. You get this basic header, and also pretty much you don't even have a footer. If you try and search for a page that doesn't exist on your website, in fact, let's just add some gibberish here, your search results page will look like this. And I'm sure you can agree with me, this is not really, you know, exciting. So now let me show you how you can transform your website using the Genesis template. So what I'm gonna do here is I'm just gonna go to my WordPress admin dashboard and to install this template is very, very straightforward. You come all the way down here where it says Divi, click on theme builder, and then you want to come all the way over here to the top right, click on these two arrows, and then click on import. Here you can see it says no file selected. We want to install the file. So in your case, if you purchase the template, it's only $9, you will get a file which I'm about to install right now. So if I click here, uh, I can go to my file. It's 1.2. Double click on that. Click on import DV theme builder templates. So once this install has completed, you're going to have all those things that I talked about. The header, the footer, the 404 page, the search results page. So pretty much just by doing those little clicks, it's gonna transform your website. Now that it's finished installing, let's take a look and see what this looks like now. So these are all the components of our template. So I'm gonna save changes. And then if I come back over here, let's head over to our homepage. So on our homepage now, you can see that we now have a header. And if I scroll all the way down here to the bottom, you can see now we have this beautiful footer. Now we're not done yet because we haven't added our logo. So let's, let me show you how to add the logo. Back over here, we're going to go to theme options. And then we're gonna come over here to logo, click upload. So let me see if we have a logo in here and we have these basic ones. So you know what? I'm just gonna use one of these. So I'm gonna go with this crosswire. Set as logo, save changes, and then back over here, if I refresh this, notice what happens. It's gonna add my logo on here on the site and also add it to the bottom. So you can see here, in fact, it's very small, but if I come all the way down here, again, it's really, really small. So what do you do in that situation? Well, all you gotta do is to come back over here to the theme builder, and then you want to go into your global header, and adjust the size of this logo. The good thing about this template is you can actually go in and make some customizations and pretty much change all the colors, the fonts, and everything that and anything that you want you may want to change on this template. So as you can see here, this logo is very small. I'm gonna go in here, click on design, and click on sizing. So this is where you can actually increase the size of this logo. So as you can see here, I can bring it up all the way to about, let's say, 56%. Save that. Save it one more time. And that's all you need to do to update your logo. So if I come over here and refresh this page, you can see now our logo is nice and big. And over here on the bottom as well, it's you know increased a little bit. So if you wanna add or edit all these uh, links, you can go in and add your own links to these links that we have here by default. And, the, and as I mentioned before, you can also change these background colors to match your branding. Now, let's take a look at the 404 page. What happens if someone searches for a page on your website that doesn't exist? If I just do that, and uh, now we have a beautiful 404 page. Again, you can go in, make some customizations, and if someone is really lost and they come onto this, if they click homepage, it will automatically go to your homepage on your website. So as you can see, I'm back to my homepage. Now you may be thinking, okay, Mac, why is it my header here is cut off? Now to really see this design, you have to log out once you've finished making your customizations and it will look better that way. Let me prove to you that that's the case. So if I open in a new incognito window, go to my website again, this will now show you the actual website how it would look. So this is now my header. We also have a search panel here. So let's say people want to search for things on your website. They can just come over here and search for whatever it is they want to search on your site. And if there's nothing on the website, look, this is now our search results page. And again, it's well designed. We now have a footer and 
it's really highly customizable. Now, this template is only $9 and you can use it as many times as you want on as many websites as you want. But the most important thing is this template is very, very easy to use and it saves you a lot of time creating headers, footers for your website. Now, if you're a VIP member, you get all these templates absolutely free. All you have to do is to log on to funnels2income.com and go to your dashboard and you can go ahead and download it from there. But if you're not a member, of course, the link to buy it is in the video description below. It's only $9. So go ahead. The link to that is in the video description below. That's all I have for you in today's video. Thank you very much for watching. If you have any questions, please ask me in the comments box below and I'll do my best to respond to your questions. Thank you very much for watching.